At a time when India is positioning itself as a global AI powerhouse, a report by CXXO, an initiative by Kalari Capital, reveals that women make up just about 20% of India's AI workforce. On the sidelines of Taikon Delhi 2025, CNBC TV 18's Aishwarya Anand spoke exclusively with Vani Kola to understand what this means for India's AI ambitions. Take a look. Well, AI is very new. Correct. And uh, new and change aren't always easy to embrace and accessibility of tools and opportunities are also very dependent on networks that enable that for you and those are things that uh, I think we start with a back step, right? Women start with a back step. But we have to be optimistic, which I am, AI more than any other technology from before has the opportunity to truly be transformative about the elusive goal of equal participation. So I think it's about less about what is holding women back, more about how do we raise awareness for it and how do we encourage more to join because uh, knowledge and technology, core technology is not a barrier. There are tools that allows you to truly train yourself and uh, be uh, representative in um, uh, democratizing solutions. And you can do that without having to be a technologist or an engineer with the help of AI. Okay, so that brings me to the next part of the question, which is uh, when we look at the funding ecosystem, right? Uh, Women-led AI startups have received less than 10% of the total funding that was raised by AI startups since 2020. So from where you sit today as an investor, what's driving this disparity and how can the venture ecosystem course correct? You know, I know we want uh, everything to be neatly boxed, yeah. but life doesn't work like that. Yeah. For venture ecosystem to course correct, uh, we also need to first create aspiration for more women entrepreneurs to be leaders and uh, for more women to be entrepreneurs, leaders and founders. And okay. that's what today's event, conversation, the report is to raise awareness, increase, of course, networks and increase the community that can mentor, champion, uh, angel fund, open those networks to them, Correct. right? You know, through the CXXO program, uh, you have been directly supporting women founders for years now. So I want to understand that, uh, could you just shed some light on how much capital till date have been deployed to women-led startups and what outcomes have you seen in terms of scale-ups, in terms of exits or follow-on funding rounds? So um, we started uh, putting together uh, specific allocation of capital and we started with uh, 15 million dollars only specifically for yeah. women yeah. Uh, founders especially to give them that early seed capital right and uh, i feel for every dollar we invest into enabling a woman they will then be able to leverage that in time and raise a hundred dollars right almost all of the companies uh, fortunately have received follow-on funding and that shows that you know if you kind of give that initial push. energy and push and mentoring um, lots of good things can come out of it and with that it is a wrap on this edition of startup street more news and updates coming up on the other side stay tuned